This is just going to be a short video on how to customise your icons on your iPod Touch or iPhones. The first thing I need you to do is go to your web browser and type this link in. modmyi.com Then we can press enter. Then what I need to do is click on downloads. And then if, if you've not subscribed to this site before, I, you need to. It'll only take a minute to do it and then you can download as much things as you want. So, so after you've done that, click, look through all the categories and click on icons only. And then there's a lot of icon packages that are not in Cydia. So these are really useful if you like customising. I found one that I like on page 3. when it loads scroll down so on then just click download safari icon then open it with winrar or whatever tool you use to extract your folders and then just drag the icon or icons onto your desktop. Then what I need you to do is create a folder. You can name this folder whatever you, you like. I'm gonna name it I Geo. And inside this folder I need you to create another folder called Icons with the capital I then just go into that folder and then drag your picture that you've just downloaded into this folder then what I need you to do is open up WinSCP if you don't know how to SSH into your iPod or iPhone just look in the link description I've got a video on that then just open it up It's not responding. <laughs> right, if it crashes, just close the program down and then reopen it, and it should work fine. Just double tap, type the password in Alpine. If you don't know how to win to SSH into your device, just look in the video description, and there should be a link to a video on how to SSH. Once you get to this screen. I need you to go to, to the top and then double click to go back. Then I need you to scroll down and find a folder called Stash. Double click on there and then there'll be seven or eight folders. If you see the themes one, just go back to your desktop and drag the folder that you just made into that themes folder. Then just click copy. Then what I need you to do is come to your device and then go into Winterboard. Then the, th then the theme that you've just put in through SSH will be at the top. I just want you to click it, go back, it will respring. Give it a minute. Unlock it. And then as you can see, the, the Safari icon has changed. It's as easy as that. You can mix, mix and match with loads of different icons from that site or from the ones off Cydia. Thanks for watching. Please rate, subscribe and comment. See you later.